So children, in yesterday's classes, I had uh, explained you that if it is so true that uh, the Shiva um, is the first homo sapiens, means he is having the power, he is a group leader, he is very famous among the people of that time as per Davidian theory. That's why he was selected as a human. He was the homo sapiens. Okay, means he is a human. So how can we pray a human? I am not preaching here and uh, Islamic or any other laws. So he is not the power. Maybe he have worshipped something. He is struggling that time. Even he is not having the time to worship. Hmm? He is understanding the environmental condition. That what we are. If we want to do a nice agriculture crop, we have to look at the rain hmm? at the sky. When the rain falls according to the season, this season we understood. Lot of things the first survivors have struggled hard and they came and they given this up to us. So, then the second incarnation Vishnu, how he could uh, be, see the story comes, his first Masya Avatara, Kurma Vara, and that half human, half uh, fish, he uh, and Devon stole some Vedas or something from Brahma, and then he protected that. How it could be possible? How we can believe this? Is it so? No. So, a half human, half uh, fish, okay, not accepted, he is not the human. We are here only talking here about the humans. So, if they are existing, if they are having supernatural powers, why not they are still in between us? I mean, some say that they are unseen to us. Okay, unseen to us, but they are having super powers now. They can not only do it, if they are having any anger opportunity, they can go to the African people, they can go to the North Asian people or American people. Never, 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 never in the mosaic law starting from the Adam to the Al Avatar Muhammad. Hmm? After that, never we have seen the superhuman beings with multiple hands and multiple legs, multiple hmm, heads. And we have not even seen the phoenix. The Egyptian phoenix or the Greek phoenix, the human head, the lion body and that. Hmm? So, according to us, up to our research, we came to the conclusion that this is the generation which was destroyed by the god earlier, like the Atlantis. Hmm? How Atlantis was destroyed, still it was under the water. In the same thing, some historians say that Atlantis is nothing but water. Whatever the consequences, we come to that afterwards. First, I need understand this. So, it is a wrath of God. See, another thing uh, from this I want to tell you. If Krishna and Baldama are the incarnations of God, they are having the purpose. What is the need that uh, to flee away from Mathura to Dwaraka, he built his own city by the fear of Jarasandha. Jarasandha. Okay. So, means they are all lived as a humans. They lived human life whatever. Hmm? They died in their natural death. So these, the Jewish people, Jewish Brahmins are making our Indian land divided. We have become, dif- uh, they have become a lot of differences in between as human to human. Even the way of worship is different. We can worship, but this is not the history. If we dig the history, we can dig out a lot of things that, and history class, because of the, some uh, extra disturbances so I can't be able to pass you the message so we discussed upon one more topic that this the BJP's government we are not uh, in having any enmity with them the person among them Sarumbramanam Swami he said that uh, we are sometimes he said that he is the Dravidian, uh, he opposes the Dra- our Dravidian theory, and sometimes and now is on the hot talk that Aryans didn't invade India. What we read from our childhood, Aryans uh, invaded India from that uh, northwestern area. Uh, then he, they overthrown the this Dravidian. They migrated from Harappa, Mohenjo-daro to South India. Now they are taking telling that respect. If time comes, again they say that we are the natives of India, we have born from the Indian land as a plants and trees. Can you accept children? No, you can't. We can't. So, here, the study's topic, the main point, a big story I told you, 
that uh, take the example of Pira Basveshwara, the Basavana of Kalyani, Basva Kalyani. He used to work under the King Bichela of uh, Shor Balami, Shor Chalukyas, and Bengi Chalukyas. These are having connections. Mm-hmm. So before the, they worked under the vassals of uh, Ikshwaku, Satavahanas, and many more. So what happened with Bichela and uh, Basavana? He was the Prime Minister under this rule. He murdered him. What the reason? See, the king is the worshipper of Vishnu and Basvarna is the worshipper of Shiva. So, he didn't accept it. His proposal, he made the king to force, force the king to worship all the state as a single, we have a single, we must have a single god that is Shiva. Vishnu is not, we should not have to worship him. As a result, the king didn't accept his proposal and he rejected. Then what happened? He murdered him. Who? Oh, the Basavan. Then what happened? He flew away by the fear of death. Who may be, they may be people of the king who the courtiers of the king may kill me and he taken the shelter in the Kagatya Empire which was at, uh, at the time the tribal people lightly developed some a few dirty kings under the Shalukya rulers and Rashtrakutas. So there he came and he encouraged them the Bira Shaivism. He flourished from the South India and many hmm, up to the South India and as well as North India. As a result, nearly lakhs and lakhs of temples are destroyed here. Most temples, Vaishnavist temple, as well as Buddhist monasteries, Jain monasteries are destroyed. Still, if you observe the uh, Vishnu temples that are uh, in the temple, if you see, we find Linga. So the construction of Gopura, that is different. But here we are finding the idol is different according to the Hindu mythology. So what happened here? They only destroyed their kingdoms, the people. 